Well, an eight-year-old boy in Detroit is spreading his love of Halloween the best way he can. Yeah, he suffered from health problems, but that is not stopping him from getting in on some spooky fun. Will Jones joins us live on the west side this evening. And, Will, he really has worked hard for this. Worked extremely hard, Karen and Damon. We were out here with Kingston this morning. He comes out here every morning to make sure everything is in good condition. And you can understand why he spent his hard-earned money on this Halloween display. Hey, Kingston. How are your inflatables today? Eight-year-old Kingston Hosang loves Halloween. We would go, go around surrounding neighborhoods and just check out different displays. Last year, Jolene Hosang and her husband promised Kingston if he saved up his money, he could put up a Halloween display at their home on Detroit's west side this year. I was just surprised how fanatical he was about it because, you know, at one point my husband was just like, oh, we're going to have another inflatable meeting. By summer, he was ready to go, saving up $345. Yeah, I had so much money. We were going to Home Depot literally every week checking to see if they were selling any of the Halloween decorations. Neighbors took notice as his Halloween display started taking shape in August. I was certain that they would just be irritated or annoyed at the fact that it was up in the month of August. How? How do I? How do I? annoyed just because it's not even the month that we're celebrating halloween halloween is in what month uh, uh, october, october. <laughs> every morning kingston makes sure everything is in working order i think you're ending like this <sighs> oh okay you make sure that they don't fall over yeah making for a memorable halloween for kingston who can't take part in some traditions of the holiday because he's unable to swallow Usually when Kingston goes trick-or-treating, right, typically he just gets uh, candy uh, of which he can't ever eat. And so this uh, allows him to in and continue to enjoy Halloween on his own terms. I would have been happy. Kingston isn't done with Halloween decorating just yet. He wants to add more decorations. Those decorations, though, will go inside the home. We're live on Detroit's West Side. Will Jones, Local 4.